so hi friend this is amit and you are watching my channel information and educational video so in this video i will talk about sastra counseling that is going on so here i will talk about the expected cut off for the next round as you all know the first round allotment has been done and so many students didn't get any type of seat so here i will provide the expected cut off for the next round so that you can expect whatever seat you can get in the next round so next is all branch cut off i will discuss till the last round not the next round there will be multiple rounds that is left for the sastra counseling 2021 so so i will discuss the cut off that you can expect till the last round so you can expect there will be increment in the cut off that i will provide you that is the expected till the last round so also i will talk about what to, uh, what to do now because many student have got a part of got a seat but they are not interested in that and many student didn't get a seat so how you can do sliding or not so all those things i will discuss in this video and i will also talk about the safe rank that you should at least have to get a seat in this sastra counseling and refund policy what is the fee you have to pay and reason for less cut off so if you are first to my channel please try to subscribe this channel so that you will get all the update about sastra counseling other counseling other entrance exam including jee mains jee advance in this channel only so please try to subscribe and one more information if you need counseling guidance for any type of counseling that is sastra amrita or any other that you will do this year you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number available in the description box once you register with me by pay by paying some amount then i will take full responsibility of your all counseling and i will provide you the best out of your rank so if you need you can contact me but if you if you want to ask only question then you can ask in the comment section but if you want the counseling guidance then only use the whatsapp or insta id because for that you have to register with me so let's start this video so here is the main points about the sastra counseling that you need to keep in mind in order to do the counseling carefully and this information is very important the first information is you can't change the preference order now uh, they, they told in the information voucher that they may provide you to change the preference order later but now you will you will not able to change the preference order what you have submitted that will be used for the next round also so there will be merge round after third round so in that they might provide you the option to change your preference so that you can change the preference because that is the most important thing once once you do mistake in that you will not get the best out of your rank so next is uh, there will be merge round also later that i have told you uh, that is after third round there will be merge round that is all type of student will be considered as same and uh, and you can do sliding only after paying that is if you get any type of seat no matter biotechnology or space you have to pay the amount that is 92000 then only you will able to participate in the next round so it is very important so for sliding also that is sliding means you are accepting this seat and you are looking for the better seat in the next round so that is advisable once you not pay the fee you will be not eligible for the next round your, your counseling will be done so it is advisable if you get any type of seat and if you want the improvement and you are, you are interested in sastra counseling then you should pay the fee then only you will be eligible for the next round so next is what you should do now so what i have suggested that if you get any type of seat you should pay the fee if you don't get any type of seat you should wait you you don't need to do anything but if you have got you have to pay the fee but you are very sure that you you will not get any type of seat or you you don't want to take admission in sastra then uh, you should not pay the fee and then you will be out of the counseling but if you pay the fee later also if you don't want to take admission then you can apply for the refund you will get the 100% refund why so many student did not get any type of seat so this is a very important question because every student is so much tense i don't know why sastra is doing the counseling for other state student if they have to provide all the all the seat to the tamil nadu student or more important to the two district hall that is trichy and tanjavur a student so why they are conducting the counseling for other state student because they are when after getting so good rank they are not able to get the seat. so what is the use of this counseling if if you have to provide all the seat to the local student then uh, provide them directly why you are they are doing the counseling for other state student because they are uh, now so much tense to so uh, it's my advice to all the student who are from other state just wait nothing can be done because i think they have already so sold the seat through the management quota that's why they are providing very less seat through the counseling and that's why they haven't revealed the seat matrix so you can see, you can think that there uh, there is something wrong going on through uh, in the sastra counseling but nothing can be done these are the private institution they can do whatever they they want so nothing can be done here i it's my advice just to wait for the next round if you are interested in sastra 
just wait and if they provide the facility to change the preference try to change so next is what about the cutoff for next round next i will talk in this video about the cutoff of next round uh, what about refund so refund i have already told you after 1st september you can ask for the refund but they haven't revealed the last date but according to the ugc guideline that the, i think the last date will be at least till october or november so, I, so you can ask for the refund after 1st september itself but the last date is not fixed so i will suggest if, if you are not interested in the seat uh, that you have got you should ask for the refund as soon as possible so now talk about the expected cut in the last round you can expect csc core that is the computer science engineering core branch cut off will be around 150 rank till the last round because csc seat any student will not left uh, after getting that so the cutoff will not go to uh, go so much higher but for CSCS specialization you can expect around 400 rank you will get the seat and for IT 350 because CSCS specialization have some specialization which are less uh, demandable as uh, as compared to IT so IT cutoff will be 350 and for ICT that is information communication technology so uh, so the cutoff will be 700 so for EC the cutoff will be 950 so one more thing I would like to tell you that if, if your rank is higher than that then also you can expect but you have to do the counseling carefully because they allow you to change the preference you have to change according to the requirement and your expectations so if you want counseling guidance you can contact me then I will provide you the right preference order and that you need to fill in order to get the best out of your rank so if you need you can contact me uh, but for that you have to register with me so next if you talk about ECS specialization the cutoff till last round will be 1.1 thousand and uh, for triple E and triple E specialization combined cutoff will be 1.5 thousand and uh, EI the cutoff will be 1.6 thousand and for mechanical and mechanical specialization combined the cutoff will be 1.8 thousand and for aerospace and civil engineering the combined cutoff will be 2.5 thousand or more than that also because uh, I think very less students are, are interested in those branches because those branches are not as demandable as the CSIT EC branches are. So uh, you can expect there will be uh, so much increment in the cutoff of non-tech branches. So if you want non-tech branch then you can get at very high rank also but you just need to do the counseling carefully because once they provide you to change the preference order you have to change according to your expectation and, uh, and there I will help you once you register with me for the counseling guidance I will help you for all the counseling not only Sastra but after if after this if you want to do JOSA counseling for JE mains or any other counseling that you will do that is TSM set or any other that I will help you but once you register with me by paying some amount then only so so if you want you can contact me through Instagram or WhatsApp number so next if you talk about the last biotechnology and mechatronics the cutoff will be 3000 and 2, uh, 2000 respectively so you can see that uh, now uh, according to the cutoff these cutoff are so much higher but, but trust me the cutoff will go to so much higher rank right? because everyone is taking Sastra as a backup option very less student are so much uh, so much dedicated for this college so it's my advice to keep your patience and be positive for the next round and you will get the seat for sure if your rank lie between uh, between those rank that i have provided and higher than that uh, higher than that then also you can get but you have to do the better counseling because there will be much counseling after the third round and there your your chances will be maximum so thanks for watching this video please try to subscribe this channel and if you need counseling guidance you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number available in the description box uh, only if you need counseling guidance because once you register with me i will take full responsibility of your all counseling not only sastra the all counseling that you will do this year until your final admission is done so please try to subscribe and share this video to your friends so that they can also get this information